take a break, have a drink, sample some of the excellent food at the Stampede, and you'll have a better time. With Stampede kicking off in just under a week, Calgarians are ready to yell you hey or wait or Yahoo as they shake off their stampede of rust. The celebration returns in full force after two years of COVID-19 disruptions. We ask Calgarians their best do's and don'ts when it comes to taking on stampede. Plan your schedule ahead. You go on the website and it'll show all the events and the times. I find the easiest way to enjoy stampede is to go camping. Drink many beer and have a good time. So I'm looking forward to the parade. Um, I'm looking forward to the fireworks. I love pancakes, so I've heard that that's like a big part of Stampede Week, the pancake breakfast. Andrea Irwin is new to Calgary and quickly got acquainted with the city after seeing the Yahoo sign backwards from her apartment balcony and asking her neighbor what the sign meant. I texted her, I was like, hey, when did they put up this ooh hey sign? And a couple of minutes later, I got a text message from her and it was just like, oh yeah, the Yahoo. I think it's there for Stampede. And with the city gearing up to celebrate, there are some things Stampede goers should steer clear from. In terms of don'ts, uh, don't drink and drive. Uh, it's never a safe thing to do. And always remember to have a lot of fun. I think the weather really is, uh, you know, unpredictable. You, you don't know if it's going to rain. Rain or shine, Calgarians have a lot to look forward to as the 10-day celebration comes back in full force. Most looking forward to the moment when the guy, like, holds up the... Yeehaw! No, no, it's the Yahoo! <laughs> Irwin saying she'll take in Stampede donned in Western gear with her dog Eugene sporting his flashy red bandana. In Calgary, Jillian Code, City News.